I tell you what, us boxing fans have been very spoilt recently. I've never known a time we're in such close succession. The biggest possible fights that could happen are happening. Um, and they're happening within the month of each other or scheduled to have be happening in the month of each other. And it's a great place to be. 2024, so far is looking good. Looking forward to AJ and Ndanu. What a fan-friendly fight that's going to be. Ngannou has shown, you know, he can live with the big boys. You know, I thought he nicked it against Tyson Fury. Knocked him down, controlled the action, didn't look hurt at any stage. Having his first ever boxing match. You no know, credit where credit's due. That was probably one of the best boxing performances, you know, all being equal. Who in their first ever boxing match, amateur or pro, could perform at the elite, elite level? I don't know anybody. Um, but Ngannou's that guy. And who's he getting in the ring with? He's getting in the ring with Anthony Joshua, who himself, I've got a few for the <laughs> a few dogs in the house here. Oh, no. What's going on, man? <laughs> yeah, it's a great time. It's a great time to be a boxing fan. And as you see the Ongano challenge against uh, Anthony Joshua, I think Anthony Joshua's new style, he's adapted his old style, he's upgraded his style to more of a pure boxer versus sort of box fighter where he would hold his feet and trade when he didn't really need to. And when he was, he wasn't punching with defense in mind. It was all offense, which at, up to a certain level works. But when you get to that next, the, the, the elite of the world's best fighters, you need to mix it up. You might need to pick and choose your spots and moments to get involved. Um, you know, looking back at the Ruiz fight, you know, he got hurt and he just he tried to double down. And that's, that can work. But what would have um, worked is if he'd have implemented what he did in the Ruiz second fight. So once he realized he'd been buzzed. But it's, it's hard to change from one style to another. But now he's implemented his uh, new style where he's picking and he's, he's moving his feet, he's fainting, he's, he's looking for the shots and putting little clusters together. It's, uh, it's just looking good. And uh, Tyson Fury, Usyk happening May 18th. Hopefully fight the winner of Ghana and AJ on March the 8th. We're moving, we're moving. The heavyweight scene's moving nice. And um, I'm happy it's... Uh, I'm happy boxing has found this the saviour. Um, the Saudi Arabia, Turkey El Sheikh has made the impossible possible. And long may he reign with the with boxing being his passion. And uh, the only people who um, who benefit are the fans, are the fighters, or everyone involved in boxing. So. Yeah, I know we've got a little bit of negativity from some parts of the world trying to point fingers and cast judgment when the, um, whoever they are, I look back at the, the environment you're in before you start pointing fingers. All right, guys, have a nice one.